Hey everyone, Toby Game Time here. Welcome back to another review video. Right now, I'm going to be reviewing something I got um, just yesterday. Now, um, so there's actually um, certain pieces. First, we're going to start off with the toy crossbow P. I think it's PSX or PX20 or PSX20. I'm not sure. Next generation toy crossbow. Now, it comes with three darts. Which is kind of pointless since, like, if I were taking my friends, we wouldn't use the dart. We just pretend, like, you know, it's blood, and we would. Pre since we aren't, since whenever he and I hang out, we when we use toy guns, we would pretend that we're not shooting at other people. Plus, we don't use dart guns because, eh, needing to pick up the darts and getting mixed and getting confused between whose darts is whose. We don't like get. We would hate the fact of getting confused. So, if I. And my friend and I may be hanging out today. I don't know. Uh, my mom. I don't know. My mom's kind of eh. She she. I mean, she wants my room cleaned up tomorrow. So if so, like it if I were to come over to my friends, you know, I might not be able to spend the night. At least hang. We would, we would be able to at least hang out. Because like he wanted uh, uh, if he stays Friday, he wanted to spend the night. We'll see. Because my mom might just. If so, my mom will at least let me to come hang out. Uh, either way. <gasps> Ow! Darn! If you think that, if you thought that does not hurt, try it for yourself. It doesn't hurt that bad, but I wasn't expecting it. When you're not expecting something, it's going to hurt a lot worse. Than like when, you know, like, like, if I, like, if my brother comes downstairs and shoots me in the back of my so kind of, I may see it on camera, but I may not be expecting it. Well, now I might expect it because, you know, I just, the idea popped in my head. But, like, ow. I was expecting that, and it still hurt. That does hurt, trust me. Because, you know, it's got good power to it. Like, this thing can shoot very far. 50, was it feet or meters? I don't remember what the packaging says. I already threw it out, so. Um. It's, it can shoot quite far though, which is cool. Here's an action shot of me with my cool skinny arms. <laughs> action shot. Boom. Oh, you guys need to see the crossbow. Boom. There. Happy. Jeez. This is cool. I like it. I've always... The reason why I got this is because I was, I've been wanting the Nerf Zombie Strike crossbow for a while. And I figured... Hey, it's a crossbow, might as well get it. I saw it at Toys R Us for 11 bucks, very cheap. Okay, it was like 10 something, with, but if you had tags, it would be 11 bucks. At least where I live, I live in America, so yeah. This is cool. Fairly compact. You can't stick it in a holster, obviously, because you got this. I could disassemble it, but I'm not going to because it was a pain in the butt to get the ha handle, whatever you want to call this. I, I forgot the name to it, whatever it's called. This was a pain in the butt to get in. Like, I seriously had to... Sheldon... Yeah, they're back for... At least until, um... Tuesday... Of next week. So, this... I just... I had to have him bend this so I could bend this to get the bowstring on. This is a very cool toy, though. It's... By far my most favorite bow that I have. I do have a couple other toy bows. But... Concerning the fact that... You know, you you can keep this hidden like under your shirt or something. I don't know. You can hide it somewhere, like under a trench coat. It'd be like an assassin. You can hide. It's a lot more conceal. Con you can conceal a crossbow pistol a lot better than a silenced handgun because you know suppressors. They aren't gonna stick in a concealed carry holster. Even if you had the Urban Carry holster, which is by far probably the best holster that the people who make holsters make. Oh, I gotta pull my pants up. But yeah, very concealable, especially in real life. You know, you don't you don't even need two fingers. You can just take one finger. Heck, if I want to, I can use my pinky and pull it back. It's, it doesn't require a whole lot of strength to pull back. Like even a baby could pull it back, and that's not. I'm not kidding either. A, a baby literally. If they, if they had the brains to it, like obviously babies have a brain, but if their brain was de developed enough, a toddler could pull this back. 
seriously, like one finger. It doesn't require much strength at all. You could be the weakest person alive and still be able to pull this. I'm not weak. Seriously, it's, it doesn't require a whole lot of pull. You don't need to pull back fast. You just pull back nice. You see, and it doesn't require you to use all your might. You just pull. Like with a real crossbow, like certain crossbow strings, like, you know, bow strings, require you to use all your strength. Like, you know, the ones that we stick your foot in that um foot hold holder whatever you pull the bowstring up that would require strength this obviously did not require much strength plus it's a toy they wouldn't have it we that's a slingshot that's a slingshot right in my hand or something I don't know what the words are oh, I sh but you can anyway oh that hurt ow baby Pulls back. And those were the fingers that hurt. I'm surprised that didn't make it hurt anyways. Gosh, that stunk. Oh, darn it, that hurt. Gosh. My knuckles are red. I don't know if you guys can see, but my, my knuckles are like turning red. Ah, holy cow. What the crap, that hurt. Oh my gosh, darn it, that sucked. But yeah, anyway, um, so, ow. Don't pull back here. So there's this in the way, plus you gotta pull it down here. You wanna grab the bow like that? You can use, if you want to, I don't know why you need to, you can do that. Use your form, use your thumbs on the back of the, uh, on the back of there, and then pull the bowstring back with four fingers. You honestly wouldn't need to. You just pull back. You can even use one finger, kind of like with certain bows. Pull. Now, I can try for this all I want since it's not a real bow. The bow string isn't going to get any wear and tear on it. So I can fire this all I want. The only way it would break is if I were to like physically break the bow string. This is cool. I, I think it's awesome, especially since you can shoot very far with it. You don't have... Now, you definitely need to aim, especially since you cannot put a scope on it or anything. You definitely got to... Keep your aim game going. Especially if you can take this to like a Nerf gun war or something. It's not a Nerf gun, but you can still use it as a Nerf gun. Or, how about we say a dart gun war? You can take it to a dart gun war. It's definitely a good weapon. Now the reason why I held it like that is because you no, know, it's up close. If I do like, if I do it like that, you guys, you know, I get as much. Now I know it's in my left hand. I'm a right-handed shooter. Now it's a, it's a pistol, so you hold it like that. You aren't going to... Hold it like that because that just looks weird. You hold it like that. It's a pistol, basically. A single shot crossbow. Well, all crossbows are single shot. Well, actually, there is semi-automatic ones, which have like a magazine, and then there's like two bow strings, and they pull back every. I mean, shoot. Well, they pull back on, on their own. It's called the autocross. It's in Far Cry 4. I don't know if many of you have seen it because I don't think many of my people. Any many of the people who have me watch Far Cry 4 or played it even. This reminds, it reminds me of Han Solo's gun plus um, the autocross. I don't know why. Anyway, so you know, it comes with these two darts. You can stick them here or you can load one as I have shown. So if this video is going to be short for some reason, I would get to like maybe 20 minutes and then my camera is like, oh, you. Like, I can't even go over to, like, I can't even go a couple seconds over to me. I think it's under 20 minutes I can go. Anyway, this, um, came with the bow, the darts, and last but not least, a target that, unfortunately, only goes on glass surface. I cannot stick this on a wall, which stinks. I, I one reason why I think it's because the darts will not stick to, um, wooden surfaces they need. Like a plastic or glass surface to stick on, otherwise they aren't gonna stick. So it makes sense that you can really stick this on like smooth areas. Now, well, I mean, I'm not saying a wall isn't smooth, but like, why well, can only stick to um, surfaces like plastic? Oh, I don't know if you guys can see that, but there's like a bump forming on my hand right there. Oh, I don't think nothing. It doesn't really hurt. It's just a bump. It's not anything serious. Trust me. It's not broken or anything. 
I'm fine, I know that. It's not bad. Trust me, I know my medical stuff is just a bump. It'll go away in a matter of days. Trust me, I sprained my wrist, but that's one reason why I didn't. I mean, it was just sprained, I could have recorded a video. But I just wanted, I don't know. The reason why I may not record for like almost a week is just eh. I'll try to upload more. Especially since the weekend is coming up, I know it's summer and I can record this constantly as well. Now, I know I'm wearing my George Washington University shoot shirt. I, oh, I legit almost said the S-H word, I'm not kidding. I'm, I was getting confused there, but like, yeah, it's a um, George Washington University shirt. I'm hoping to maybe start getting, like, merchandise going. Even I may wait till I have, like, uh, 200 videos, because it'd be cool to, you know, I'm not, may not necessarily sell it, but it's like a giveaway to all stuff, and there's only going to be a certain number that are signed, so if you want to sign a t-shirt, go in the comments below, type it, there's 20 shirts going out, because I have 28 so far, in fact, that'll be the 10 subscriber special, now, depending on when I get to 200 videos, that's when we'll, I'm hoping, now, what's it going to have, it's going to have like, kind of like this, where it's got, now, if you guys want, now, there may be hats, there may be long sleeves, not just short sleeve shirts, like, if you live, I don't know, you, go in the comment section below if you want to sign a t-shirt, I'll only, um, sign eight, so, if you, hopefully you become a lucky eight, and you, um, get in, now, if you've got, now, if I need to mail it to you, let me know if you're a friend of mine that lives close, I can just take it to your house, good to let me know what size you wear also because I don't want to like start making sure to have like no sizes for like the wrong size. But if I do an email to someone, um, I don't know how you're going to comment me. Um, I'll leave my um link to, um, you can just add me on Google Plus, um, my, um, my Google, um, email for G my Gmail for, um, my YouTube account will be in the description below. You just... I'm not gonna say in the video I want you guys can just go add me on Google Plus, let me know your address. I can send it send the, if you need if I need send shirt. Now if you're if you're like my friend Nick, I'll just take the shirt to you. I'm not gonna mail it because I it's not that far of a walk, it's literally not even a mile to his house from where I live. It's a good fifteen minutes though, but I know walking a mile would take a lot longer than fifteen minutes. If you're driving in a car, a mile is about five minutes, I think. So, you know. Ow. So, yeah, I, if you're someone that lives close, which there's only my friend Nick who really lives necessarily close. I do have, like, a, some other friends I can go. It depends. If, yeah, I don't have Google Plus because I don't want to, like, accidentally... I don't want you guys, like, typing in your, email, your, um, edges and people, like, you know, um, people go, <laughs> people, um, following the address to do bad things, I don't know, just don't be typing that in the comments, uh, add me on Google Plus, I'll let me know your address, well, do it right now, because I'm not sure when I'll be doing t-shirts, plus, I'm only 15, and plus, it costs money to, um, make custom t-shirts, Depending on what you're using, like custom ink, you, I think it's five bucks to make a t-shirt. So if I if I were to make twenty eight, I don't know how much um money that would be. But when I sign a shirt, now they're gonna say teleport game time on them automatically. When I sign a shirt, it won't be my YouTube channel name. It will be my first and last name. Now, if you want to sign a t-shirt, remember, only eight of you will get a signed t-shirt. So, hurry up and say you want to sign a t-shirt now. If you want to get a signed t-shirt, say it now so you can um, get a signed t-shirt. I don't know, what, whenever I make t-shirts. I Now, I'm not making any promises that I will have shirts. But, in case I do, I mean, just to be on the safe side, um, comment down below whether you want a signed t-shirt or not. Now... The color, now, when I do, uh, I may make an extra t-shirt just for myself, 
self. I said self. I'll do. I'll wear a t-shirt my like for myself to show you guys what t-shirts are gonna look like. And there may be more than just t-shirts. There's probably gonna be like mugs and um. Now if you want a mug, obviously I have to. If it's made out of glass, I have to obviously wrap it up in like um OTs. I have to wrap it up in like you know a specific way in our mail. And um, if you want something specific like I don't know a hat or something. Now I'm I can't sign hats because, well, I could sign like a baseball cap. Like if you wanted like a beanie. I couldn't sign, I can't, I don't think I'd be able to sign that very well with the Sharpie. Unless there's like a, you know, like that plastic, not plastic, whatever it's called, you know, that like emblem that they put on my house hats. That's made out of like a material that you can write on. We'll see. I know my, um, YouTube emblem is a Beretta. Just for the sake of it, I'm not, that's why I'm not using an emblem, I'm just going to use Topic and Tyler with like, I think a red and white t-shirt. It's just too plain, let me know how. Try to experiment with colors. I'll mic on my computer. Go to custom ink and see what it. Because I might use that. But obviously, I have to give my parents permission, especially since twenty eight shirts. You know that's five. If they're five bucks, five times twenty eight. Forty. That's fifty bucks. No wait, I think I did the math wrong. Ten. Yeah, that's 50 bucks. So, if my mom's willing to buy the shirts for half a hundred bucks, or order them, whatever, you know, I'm willing, to, now if I get more subscribers before, um, whenever I reach 200 videos, I'll try my best to, um, get that many t-shirts going. I'll ha I'll I might have to constantly change, like, um, the numbers. Like, for, um, how many subs gets signed t-shirts. Actually, I think I'll keep it at 8, but, like, if you want to sign a shirt, let me know in the comment section below of this video. Anyway, enough being said, I hope you all enjoyed this video. I'll see you next one. Love you all, and goodbye. Remember, comment down below what, whether or not you want to sign a t-shirt. If you don't want one signed, that's fine. You don't need to comment. Just add me on Google+. Plus my my um, Gmail will be in the description below, so yeah, just add me on Google Plus or Gmail, whatever you want to use, and then email me, and then uh, we'll see where it goes from there. I'm not making any promises all that I will have shirts because I remember a while ago I was like, oh maybe, like I remember last year I was like, guys, hopefully we'll um, get merchandise going. Now I'm not just make money. Obviously, the shirts are going to be for free. You don't need to order them. They're for all. Everyone, like, everyone gets a shirt. It's not specific, like, no one gets a shirt, like, or a certain number. You all will get a shirt, like, everyone who subbed. It's for, it's completely free for you guys. All you gotta do is be subbed. You don't need to like or comment, obviously. But if you, well, you don't necessarily have to be subbed because my friend Nick isn't subbed. And, and if you don't want a shirt, or if you don't want anything at all, just comment. You don't have to have anything. If you just watch my videos, if you don't want anything, you don't need to like or you don't need to say anything. You don't even have to email me. But anyway, like I said, hope you all enjoyed. See you in the next one. Love you all. Goodbye. Whoa.